I would just say, how can you become this player that no one wanna have on court? And uh, how can you become? You start the match, okay? How can I do? So before you start, you need to understand two things. First, you need to have water, okay? And one normal water, one cold water, okay? Then you need to bring your towel, okay? One towel to clean your face, to water your neck, uh, your legs, whatever you want. Then you need to have another pair of socks, okay? Then you need to have more t-shirts, okay? Not just one, you need to have more. And then you need to go to the court as a professional. And how professionals go? With a bag or 12 rackets, with more rackets, uh, with uh, your tennis shoes. You need to show up in the court as a tennis player, not as, uh, as an amateur. And everything counts. And then you step into the court, you go to the court, and what is gonna happen? You gonna be the one, even before that, to take the balls from the referee, okay? You gonna bring the court, the balls to the court. This is gonna be really, really important. You are the best in the, you are the one that are leading the, the, the match, even before the match starts. So you have the balls. Then you go to the court, you are the first one, you are the first one to sit to choose the, the chair or the bench you want. You are the one choosing, okay? Then you open the, the, the can of balls and you go and you are the first one feeling the first ball. You are again leading. You are gonna be the first one warming up to the net. You are gonna be the first one warming up to the serve. And you are gonna be the first one choosing who is gonna start this or whatever you wanna do the, the things to start, you decide. But you are gonna be the one leading everything. Okay, and now another thing, your opponent plays the same as you, now you need to understand, does my player talks a lot or doesn't talk at all, okay, and you need to do exactly the opposite, so if he talks a lot, you should not talk anything, if he doesn't talk, you should talk a lot, okay, and, uh, okay, yes, besides that, you need to understand that every point, you also need to say the score, doesn't matter if you don't talk a lot, but at least the score, you need to say every single point, so don't get confused and so don't get lost, okay. And uh, now, why you need the towel, the waters and socks, uh, extra socks and t-shirts? Because you are going to the court, it's like going to the battle. You need to be prepared for everything. You need to be prepared to be there uh, five hours if you need. So I forgot about that, the food. You need to have some nuts, you need to have banana, and you need to have an uh, energetic drink. These things, because you are going to the battle. And uh, what is really important is the towel. Why? Because you are going to start the match. Now let's go. You are going to start the match as you were losing 6-0, 5-0, 4-0. Okay? And you play every single point like that. Do that and then let me know in the comments. Don't comment before you, you try. Okay? And you will play every point. Uh, like, okay, I play this point. If I lose, I'm gonna lose the point. Uh, lose the match. And this is gonna change completely your matches. It's gonna change your... Um, it's gonna change your uh, your uh, tournaments and you're gonna start to win, win, win and you cannot stop because this is the best strategy you can do. And now let's say you don't miss balls and your opponent don't miss balls. How can you make the difference? First, you need to understand, okay, you have better fitness than team, okay? You are already winning because you will get tired, you will win. Second, you can make a difference now. Every time he, he does a short ball, every time he opens a little bit more the court, you can open more the court even more than him and you can attack short balls plus you are not afraid to go to the net if you need to go okay and if you are confident to play deep to go to the net and to close with the, the volley these kind of things are gonna make the difference why because you don't miss but if you have an easy ball you will attack the ball and you will finish the point so oh my god this makes a lot of pressure to your opponent because now how can i play imagine uh, my opponent playing with me how can I defeat this Philippe? And usually you say, this guy doesn't seem like he plays anything out. This guy is number one. And this is the best strategy. I see a lot of things on the internet. I see a lot of players trying, working harder, trying to do more lessons, but they forget the basics. They forget that the, the most important thing is to understand the game, is to understand the strategies behind the tennis, behind the, the technique. This is the best advice I can give you. Try to do that. Try to try this, this method, try to do this, and then let me know. Okay, try first, okay, and I think I already said a lot of advices for you, but um, once again, set goals, okay, when in the beginning of the season, set your goals, what do you want, you want to be number one, write them down, write the, that goal down, I want to be number one, look at the goal daily, okay, when you wake up, see, I want to be number one, I will be a millionaire, I will go to Bali this summer, just wake up, see that, put in the mirror, put everything, because if you write down, if you have that ambition, you will do it. What? Why not? Everyone can do. If I can do, you can do. If uh, Djokovic does, I can do. Okay? If he believed when I was, when he was a kid, why can't you? What is the difference? 
Well, if you like this content, just uh, subscribe for more content like that. I will try my best to share as much as possible. Uh, I love tennis, I love YouTube, and uh, I love to help you to play better. I love to help you to in enhance your, uh, your tennis. And see you in this video right here that I guess you will enjoy a lot.